Hey folks, Keith with 93 Lumber, coming back at you with another beer. This is a beer that I picked up uh, <clears throat> at a liquor store that's probably like 10 minutes from here. Um, I stopped there yesterday because I was getting, um, uh, I was just getting, I'm not going to go into the whole thing, but uh, I was just getting some drinking beers for Katie and I, and uh I decided to that I was going to review this one tonight cuz you know why not Also I haven't had like most of the like this is let me get into the beer and then I will say uh this is Ale Wife Brewing it, it is there it's just the movie oatmeal stout It is 5.7% alcohol by volume and they are out of Queens New York um, and the date is 11-19-2021, even though that one looks like a four, which is weird, but <clears throat> anyway, well, I can pour this now, so. um, but yeah, I haven't, I want to review it because most of the dark beers that I, that I have are mostly like huge stouts. I don't get a whole lot of, uh, like, yeah. that looks tasty. That is just under two fingers of, a. uh, it's like a little darker than khaki, I would say. Um, but yeah. It's dark. It's not super, super dark, but get a little brownish red around the bottom. I can't see through it, but uh, yeah. Let's see what it smells like. Oh, that is roasty, roasty bitterness. Is that rye? It is. For Ted. Um, doesn't say anything about it on here. Taste is life. The potion maker, the curator of moods, the spiritual guide to all things alchemy from recipes of old to contemporary works. This smells like a yeah. It smells a little uh, Russian imperial stout. I haven't had. Not Russian Imperial. I'm pretty sure there's rye in this because it's very, very uh, something. I don't know. I haven't had a beer like this in a while, so I have no idea what I'm talking about. So I'm just going to drink it. Cheers. It is a little, it's a little, it's probably a little colder than I want it to be. I had it sitting out on the counter for a little bit, but I probably want a little bit warmer. Yeah. <clears throat> it's got a little bit of a mouth feel. I would, I would, for an oatmeal stout, I'd probably say it was a little bit thin, but yeah, it's, it's fucking spicy, spicy. I'm assuming this is, the, I'm assuming there's rye in this because this is, this is,
you know it's actually it's actually really nice because i haven't had something like this and i enjoy rye <clears throat> this is maybe for me maybe a too a little too much rye I, I know i'm weird i'm like i love this thing but there's a little too much it's it's not too much I think I, I, I think I was just not expecting it and I was I kind of had a thing in my head about what this was going to be and I wasn't expecting it so now I'm just like it sucks but it doesn't yeah that rye is so big that spicy thing is so big. <clears throat> um, there is a little bit of a like. I get a little bit of this like watered down coffee kind of thing like if you got like uh uh kind of like a maybe like a black iced coffee and then you drank it and then there was a little bit in there and the ice started melting kind of kind of that kind of thing Yeah. The rye has pretty much taken over my <clears throat> my mouth. I think it's rye. I think. Cuz it's not super bitter. It's a it's a little bit bittering, but it's it's not super bitter, so I don't I pretty sure it's rye. I haven't had like I said, I haven't had something like this in 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 a little while and usually when there's like something like this like usually they'll say like rye or just as oatmeal mm -hmm. unless that is just from hops I don't know. I have no idea what I'm talking about. <clears throat> I haven't had a beer like this in a while. And I'm feeling a little out of my realm here. Um, but it's good. I like it. Like I said, may, uh, for an oatmeal stout, a little thin. It is what did I say? Uh, 11, 19. So it is two months old, just over two months old. Um, yeah. It has taken over my I don't even taste anything anymore. It's it's like that like spicy thing. That rye spiciness has taken over so that anytime I drink it, it doesn't really taste like anything. But I'm not complaining. Because it's good. So yeah. I paid $18, I think I paid $18 for the four pack. Uh, I mean, I guess considering that I didn't have the drive to Queens for it, worth it, but.
Because I'm not even getting like a... Maybe a little bit, but usually with like oatmeal stouts or, or things that you can, that they use oats in, usually, I feel like you usually get like a little bit <clears throat> or, or not necessarily everything that they use oats in. Cause I know like a lot of IPAs and stuff like that use oats for mouthfeel and whatnot. But like, if you're going to call an, an oatmeal stout, I'm not really getting any. Like I said, maybe a little bit, but that, but that spiciness is like so big that it's hard to pull anything out of this. So anyway, I hope you're all doing well and taking care of yourselves and taking care of each other. You can like this video if you would like to subscribe to the channel. If you have not already, you can follow me on Instagram at 93 lumber That's spelled out 93 lumber. We'll see you in the next one. Cheers.